Hey everyone, how's it going? Welcome back to Let's Play Galerian's Ash. I think we're heading back to the top floor anyway, so I saved us the time and cut out the trip back from the first floor. We just have to figure out exactly where I'm going, and it's into a cutscene. What did you think you were doing? A rescue party had already been dispatched. We do not need your help! Thanks for your help back there. And as for my wound, don't worry about it. It'll take more than that to keep me down. Warning! Unidentified intruder inside terminals, floor number one. Warning! Unidentified intruder inside terminals, floor number one. Points of entry, general office, flight control office, system development. Three points at the same time? A general offensive, hmm? Close all barrier shutters and keep them confined. Cast. Yes, sir. Take a unit and head for the general office. As for me, I'm going to make for the flight control office. What about the system development center? Gavi. Yes, sir. Head for the system development center. Uh, uh, do you really want me to go? That's right, soldier. Yes, sir. I think they just sealed off the stairwell leading from uh, the second to the first floor. I want to say I saw another way down, but I think there was a, uh, a gate that was also sealed off. Oh, I just took the wrong door. I don't want to go back down to the third floor yet. Because if I'm remembering right, uh, there was a full heal and a full AP heal on the floor above uh, the fourth floor. What was it called? The the cryo sleep room? It's the room that we woke up in. My health isn't doing too bad, but my AP is way up there. I'm about to short out. So if this can sh if this can save me a uh, usage of Delmator, I'll take that. Oh, the hyper sleep room. Yeah, there it is. We'll just breathe in this green mist and feel fully refreshed. We get some aerosolized Mountain Dew down there. We inhaled it through our exposed belly button. I feel like. He's been in hypersleep for the longest time, right? So... Par Parano must be an advanced attack? Okay. I feel like he woke up and somebody just told him that that was the, the style as a prank. So he would walk around looking like an idiot. I don't think I talked to these guys before. Did I? Uh, so they left me without too much direction, but I'm assuming that I just have to go downstairs to the first floor and repel that attack. And maybe learn about a new shortcut, depending on whether or not they'll open the shutter for me. What do we have going on here? Attack Ops, Sick Bay, Lab 1, where Lilia is. Uh, oh yeah, select. Pulls up the map immediately. And lets me actually go through all the floors. So did we have another... Oh yeah, it looks like there is another set of stairs on the second floor. Warehouse 2. Oh yeah, and then we have the generator key down on the first floor. And then that fuse that was in... I think it was the warehouse on the second floor? Or no, the, the third floor. So what I would assume is that Piranha's going to escalate the attack, blow the generator, and then we're going to have to fix that. And that the game is only going to let me pick puzzle items up when they become relevant. 
which is a little bit annoying given that we've passed them a few times now. <laughs> Oh, wait, that's the armory, so... Let me just see real quick. Because I think the armory has an opening, or has a stairwell, but... New cutscene. Are you sure you want to go down? You know I'll close the gate as soon as you go through. What the hell are you thinking? It's pure suicide! Oh cool, he will let us through. But it sounds like it might lock behind us? At least until we've repelled the attack. Okay, shit's not popping off down here. Um, what about in the general office? I think the radiation spiked up a little bit. No, nothing here either. Oh, unless it's no good. There's too many of them. The other side of these shutters is already contaminated with radioactivity. It's a nightmare. They're beating us back like we were toy soldiers. <laughs> Get back. Retreat. God, his voice acting is really funny. Uh, so th I'm gonna try using my felon. Oh, God! Whoa! Okay, so they actually are a little bit dangerous. It's just the... Oh, my God! The first time I ran into them, I immediately burned all of them. So I didn't get a chance to see them do anything scary. But holy shit! to retreat. We're abandoning floor one. You have to come back with us. I don't know. That went pretty well once I set them on fire. I want, I was saying I want to use my D felon more because uh, so far Red and Nalkin look to be my boss killing resources, so I don't want to dry those up and then not have, I don't even know how that would work if I didn't have any uh, refills for uh, red or Nalkin left. Okay, so I checked Tac Ops and I went to Lilia and neither of them had anything to say, so. Okay, everybody's just retreated back up to the top. Damn it. The enemy's strength is even greater than reported by our intelligence. They've gained total control of Floor One. We've got nowhere to escape now. Our only option is to defeat Ash. How easily he says it. If we were going to attack Ash, we'd have to take over the enriched uranium refining factory. And to do that, we'd need another three bases like this one. You'll just wait instead? I've been ordered to maintain and protect this facility. I'll obey my orders. If we stay here, we're gonna die a useless death. Cast, I don't remember asking for your opinion. Request immediate assistance from the city. Yes, sir. Cass, take the remaining men. Go to floor three. Wait for the enemy there. Roger. This dude is a huge moron. So I went from the bottom to the top, back to the bottom, back to the top. I think they're giving me a little bit of the runaround here. Uh, let's see. Wanted to make sure I didn't go in the wrong uh, doorway this time. <laughs> Is 
they're making me do it a lot of running around. Lilia, is there another way to get to the uranium factory? If you take the underground passages to the hangars, the army's air beagles are there. And I can use that too. Mm -hmm. You can use it to fly to Ash's factory. That's not a bad idea. Cass. It looks like we're gonna have to take the chance and gamble on you. Hangar number two hasn't fallen yet. Because we can't leave our posts, you'll have to break through floor one and get to the hangar on your own. Can you do it? Sure. There's a guy over on that end who's a pretty good hacker and pilot. I'll get in touch and tell him to help you out. Thanks. I've secured the route from number two laboratory to number one warehouse, so you'd better go quickly. And don't worry about Lilia. I'll make sure that she's safe. Rhea, be careful. I'm coming back. You can bet on it. I don't think I had any indication that I was supposed to come to the lab to see Lilia to progress, so I, I spent a couple minutes just wandering around aimlessly. So what is this lab 2 that she was talking about? She said she opened a shutter in lab 2 that would lead down to the warehouse on the first floor. Wait, what? Where is the warehouse she was talking about? Do I have to enter the rooms before they're marked on the map? No, that doesn't make sense. Oh, wait, the shutters are the... Oh, that's what she means. Okay. It's the shutter on the on the second floor. It was locked before, but now it's open. And it was just out in the, in the hallway. Do you have anything yet? Because I keep seeing... Yeah, okay, cool. Every time I checked in on him, it was like... We'll have new PPECs soon. What if I just didn't check in with him? Would I have not gotten this? Or would I have gotten this later in the game? Bustinor! Oh, it's a homing attack. I thought it was... It, it might have been a heal. So that I could make the joke that Bustinor makes me feel good. <laughs> Oh, uh, we better refill it and immediately skip the stupid cutscene. Yup! Duh, oh, that's good. That's damn good. <laughs> Alright, so now with more clear instructions, um, we can go ahead and make our way down uh, to the second floor and then to that shutter that opened up so that we can bypass whatever has happened on the first floor since last we were down there. Wait, is it this one? It's on the third floor? Oh god, so it's uh, the shutter on the third floor that leads down to lab two, which was otherwise, I guess, inaccessible to us on the second floor, and then this has a passage down the first floor. Oh my god, that's really, really confusing how they worded this. And how it doesn't show up on the map! <laughs> Neither of them. Oh my god. These are just surprise rooms. Door to hangar number two, shutters are closed, switch beside, watch the power is not going to be on. I fucking knew it. Video game. Video game. Oh, this is for sure not opening. And there's a open. Manual device. Power is off, of course. Excuse me? 
Excuse me? Excuse me. Where does this even lead? To the sewer tunnels? Oh, it's that door. Oh God. Okay, so I think the thing was over here on the left, right? Okay, they don't do that much damage and you can mostly juke them. God damn. That's just a lot of boys. Please let me get the key now. Like, I, it, it's now or never. Okay, maybe that means we can also get the fuse now. Now that Rion knows for sure that there's a puzzle afoot. Um, wait a second. Wait a second. I lost track of which door was which, because I got so me. Oh, no, 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 no. I got so immediately spooked upon spilling out into the first floor lobby uh, that I did sort of lose track of... Okay, I see. Wait, can I take the stairs? Because that seems more convenient at this point. No. No, I can't. Also... Oh, God. What was I thinking? Nope. Oh, these were very bad ideas I had. I tried some things and they did not go well. Okay. Okay, now it shows up. I just had to enter the room to discover the surprise that it's there. I almost walked back into the general offices. So this takes me up to lab two. Or no, this takes me to warehouse two, which gets me to lab two. How did they get in? Did I let them in? Is this my fault? God. Yeah, they weren't kidding. Floor one is no longer a pleasant place to vacation. Oh, hello. We'll take that. What about down here? Is there anything I can interact with? Like the computer console? It's for PPEC analysis, but it's not turned on. And that one's just straight up locked. Okay. So eventually we'll have another way on to out into floor two, I guess. Because right now, this is a completely discreet, closed-off area from the rest of Floor 2. So I just want to pop in. Uh, I think I just went back up to the top floor. Yeah, no. I don't want to be in the control room. Uh, I want to pop in and get that fuse and then hit up the generator room. Yeah, I just took the wrong set of stairs. So I have to go from uh, lab 2 back up to the third floor and then take a different set of stairs down from the third floor to the second floor to get back to uh, the warehouse area that had the fuse in it. And I think the generator is on this floor as well. Yeah, this is the dude that needed the key. I never dreamed we'd find it. See, this is the armory. We don't need to be there. He is right. We don't have any business there right now. 
So this is the warehouse. You have got to be shitting me. I know I'm gonna get into the generator room and need that. Video game. I'm going to be cautiously optimistic here and say maybe the fuse is for something completely different later. But it still kind of sucks that I can't pick it up yet. Anyway, uh, I found out there's a direct line between this and Final Fantasy VII, and that line is Sho Tajima, who did uh, the character designs for this, or at least some of them, and for the Final Fantasy VII Turk novel. He also wrote one of the chapters for uh, the Devilman spinoff called Neo Devilman. Is the cable short-circuited? I know I need that fuse here! I know I'm about to need that. Wait. Oh, do I have to go into the inventory? I don't even remember seeing an inventory. Serum and file? Yeah, okay. Item. It's a PS2 game. We still weren't using keys automatically all the time back then. It's fine. Wow, that looks like a hot mess. It's lo it looks like it's about to explode. But it is running. Okay, let's go get the fuse. I think I'm beginning to see why this got dinged so hard uh, in the reviews back in the day. There is a pretty clear pattern developing. Uh, a problematic one of padding and busy work and just generally being given the runaround. And much of it taking place, like a lot of this running around and, and the level being padded out, is taking place in areas where there isn't that much tension. Like, floor two and above right now? Not worried about doing anything in the hallways or any of the rooms up here. It's just the first floor that was getting flooded uh, with enemies. And the tension was pretty high down there. Okay, now video game, we have the fuse. Do not refuse me again. Do not refuse to let me use the fuse. It okay, they are correct. It would be dangerous. But now I have to go and turn this off, and then put it in, and then turn it back on. The refusal of my fuse is diffusing the tension. <laughs> they refuse to let me use the fuse, and now the tension is diffused. Speaking of diffused, I hope the generator stops exploding now. No, it's still exploding a little bit. Just not as much. I don't think it should do that. <laughs> Whatever, I'm not a genius scientist computer. Elaine got this, I guess? What can go wrong trusting the world to another computer? Things are going so well right now. <laughs> oh, I'm still enjoying this game. <laughs> Nothing's gonna top Gun or Prototype 2 in terms of boring-ass bad games that make bad Let's Plays. <laughs> 
Thank you all for watching. Take it easy. Have a good one, y'all.